Mobile games have come so far, from actually this to this, and this have been done in a very small amount of time, or you can say only in a decade. And this has led to some bad people who mislead people downloading their game by showing exaggerated or to be straight fake advertisements. So today I bought you 5 games that are engaged to show fake ads. And before beginning, I just want to say that all the ads are not in 16 by 9 ratio or full screen because the ads are manually captured by me and they are not full screen. I would have stretched them but it would affect the quality of the video and because of this please don't judge my video and let's begin. Starting at number 5 is a game you probably heard of and it's Gardenscape. Like it's not a bad game, many people play it and it had been in the top 10 downloaded apps in the play store like 7 months ago. But the way of their marketing is bad and you will know why in a second when you see the gameplay. So if you have seen the ad then here is the gameplay. And here you can see nothing freaking matches. It's a whole different concept shown to people to engage them downloading the game and most of their target is of children from 7 to 10 who eventually believes every ad and downloads the game. Down at number 4 is a game which I never heard of and it's called Fishdom. So I know only one thing about this game and that is that it's totally a fraud. So let's proceed seeing the ad. And here's the gameplay so the only similarity between the ad and the gameplay is literally the fish and water and i freaking hate this fake ads so down to number three is large mobile so if you are surfing through the internet or even watching youtube from at least 2019 then you have at least watched the large mobile advertisement once the game is quite famous and just because of the clever investment in advertisement but the ads weren't actually the most honest review so here is the real game and you can notice that actually everything changed from 3D to 2D but the concept is fairly same like clans attacking each other but that doesn't mean that graphics doesn't matter. It's like showing GTA 5 and then giving GTA Advance and then the developer saying bro the concept is same. On to number 2 is Mafia CD and I have seen it at literally everywhere and a lot of times and i'm sure you also have seen it and when i hear about this game one thing comes in my mind and that is freaking fraud literally nothing matches in the game with the total over exaggerated shitty ad so gameplay is really terrible and nothing matches not literally even the concept they showed us a choice based rpg and we are getting a 2d shit they, this should be literally settled by Google Play and App Store. They should terminate this kind of people's license because they're getting downloads by their crazy driven ads and are eventually hoarding money. And finally, down to the worst, it's number one. So all the games I showed are available for both iOS and Android. But this one is an exception. This game is only available for Android because such types of games are not usually qualified for the iOS. So back to the game. So this is uh, Survival Squad Free Fire Battleground Epic Game Epic War. Why didn't they add PUBG Fortnite Call of Duty like they don't have any problem. They want to make the biggest name and not the game. So here's the trailer, like this, it doesn't match with the game, never I swear. Get ready for visual disturbance because I'm going to show you the game and here it is. The future of games and the hope of humanity. 
the game and this is oh my oh I swear NES games had better graphics than this. So I have not much to say about this game, but if they had invested the time they wasted to create the ad in the game itself, it would be way better and we wouldn't have to see this freak. I hope you enjoyed my video and if you did then hit the like button and I have daily updates, game recommendations, explosives and etc. And the best way to watch them is obviously a subscription. So please subscribe my channel and comment in down below what you would like to see in my next video. So till then this was Kazi and you are watching Mr. Visa and I will catch you in the next video.